And you mentioned that um, although platelet rich plasma has not run into any problems with things like placenta and amnion, you have to be particular and examine which company to make sure that they're following the appropriate regulatory uh, guidelines for that. And I think you had mentioned exosomes, although potentially showing maybe some promise, those have kind of had a kibosh. Yes, I think that some of the off-the-shelf orthobiologic products have really come under, uh, come under a lot of scrutiny from, uh, from the regulatory bodies, and that includes uh, placental-derived uh, therapies as well as exosomes. So, you know, as we start to use them, unfortunately, there's a uh, uh, there, there's a lot of potential there, but they've really become riskier to use uh, when uh, when being looked at uh, by the FDA. Uh, so with the autologous products are a little safer uh, from a regulatory standpoint, uh, but certainly you know this is an ongoing topic, and I hope that as time goes on, these federal agencies will, will welcome uh, more uh, conversation and uh, discussion about uh, what's helpful, and hopefully uh, the environment can get more permissive. And in your clinic, you're able to potentiate some of the products, like PRP, for example. You have some things that can upstroke the efficacy. Yes. Give us a couple examples in an older patient that might be pre-diabetic. So I'm, uh, I'm pre-diabetic myself, and uh, so 58, hard to believe. But like, so what would be something that you could do to help potentiate uh, to get a better outcome? Sure. I think more, more recently, what we've learned is that dosage matters uh, when it comes to platelets. Uh, not only does dosage matter, that matters even independent of any other host uh, uh, comorbidities or other kind of challenges. Uh, but in somebody who's, say, older or with uh, uh, compromised metabolic health, uh, I think that it's, it's helpful to realize that perhaps the platelets may not function as optimally. So we can compensate for that, either by adjusting the dosage of platelets that we use in something like platelet-rich plasma, uh, and also perhaps uh, help uh, with uh, modulating the activation of those 